Hi friends, in this video we shall solve exercise 12.1 question number 3, 4, 5 and 6. In my last video I have already solved question number 1 and 2. If you have not watched that video, you can go to the i button and you can watch. Now question number 3. There is a slide in a park. One of its side wall has been painted in some color with a message keep the park green and clean. If the sides of the wall are 15 meter, 11 meter and 6 meter, find the area painted in color. Here the slide in a park is given and the measure of the sides are given. The slide is in the form of a triangle and this area is needed to be painted. So we are asked how much area need to paint it. Since this slide is in the form of a triangle, so we will use area of triangle formula to find out the area of this part. Here a equal 15 meter b equal 11 meter and c equal 6 meter therefore we will find out as semi perimeter we will find semi perimeter is sum of all the sides divided by 2 so 15 plus 11 plus 6 by 2 so we will get 32 by 2. 32 when you divide by 2 you get 16 as is 16 meter now by using Heron's formula we will find the area needed to paint Heron formula is root over s s minus a s minus b s minus c our s is 16 16 minus a a is 15 s value 16 and b value is 11 16 minus c c value is 6 16 into 16 minus 15 gives 1 16 minus 11 5 16 minus 6 10 now we shall try to make pair 16 means 4 into 4 then 10 we can break 2 into 5 so here 4 is pair and 5 is pair so from pair one number will take out 4 and 5 will take out 5 into 4 will get 20 so inside root only 2 left so the area required will be 20 root 2 meter square now question number 4 find the area of a triangle whose two sides are 18 cm and 10 cm and the perimeter is 42 cm so in this question measure of two sides is given and third side we need to find out after that only by using Heron's formula we can find area of a triangle so first we will write a a we can take 10 cm or 18 cm b will take 10 cm c will find out so how will you find c from perimeter will subtract measure of these two side perimeter is 42 minus 18 plus 10 42 minus 28 so we'll get this one 14 centimeter so measure of third side we got now we'll find semi perimeter semi perimeter is half of perimeter Perimeter is 42, so it will be 21 centimeter. Now, by using Heron's formula, we will find out the area of the triangle. Heron's formula is root over s, s minus a, s minus b, s minus c. Our s is 21. 21 minus a a is 18 again s is 21 minus b b is 10 s is 21 minus c c is 14 now we'll subtract 21 minus 18 3 and 21 minus 10 11 and 21 minus 14 7 so 21 we can break 3 into 7 3 11 and 7 they are prime number 
Now we will try to make pair. 3 and 3 are pair. 7 and 7 are pair. So from pair, one number will come. So 3 will come. And from here, 7 will come. 7 into 3, 21. So root over 11 will left. So required area is 21 root 11 centimeter square. Now question number 5. Sides of a triangle are in the ratio of 12 is to 17 is to 25 and its perimeter is 540 centimeter. Find its area. Here in this question sides of triangle are given in ratio. So when sides of triangle are given in ratio that time we have to take x. So we will take measure of sides are 12x, 17x and 25x. Let A be 12x centimeter and B be 17x centimeter and C be 25x centimeter. So given perimeter is given in this question perimeter is 540 centimeter. Perimeter we know perimeter is nothing but sum of measure of sides. So we'll add 12x plus 17x plus 25x which is equal to 540. If we add this we will get 54x. 54 is into if you transpose right side it becomes divide. So 540 divided by 54. So we get 10. The value of x is 10. So we can find out the value of a, b and c. Therefore required value of a will be 12x. 12x means 12 into 10. 12 into 10 will get 120 centimeter. Value of b will be 17 into x means 17 into 10 170 centimeter and value of c is 25 into 10 which is equal to 250 centimeter so measure of size we got now we'll find out value of s therefore s will be half of perimeter perimeter is 540 so i'll divide 540 by 2 so i'll get 270 centimeter now by using Heron's formula we'll find out area of the triangle therefore area of triangle will be s s minus a s minus b s minus c s is 270 270 minus a a is 120 270 minus b is 170 and 270 minus c c is 250 270 into 150 into 100 into 20. Now you can do one thing. 15 means we can write 3 into 5. So 3 if you multiply with 27 we will get 81. So 27 into 3 81. Then here 5 left. 5 into 2 we get 10. And now here how many zero 1 2 3 4 5 so i'll put here 5 0 1 2 3 4 5 root over 81 means 9 now if you make this one pair 3 0 so 3 0 will come 1000 1000 into 9 will get 9000 centimeter square now question number 6 an isosceles triangle has perimeter 30 cm and each of the equal sides is 12 cm. Find the area of the triangle. Now this question is saying about an isosceles triangle. Isosceles triangle means two sides are equal. So here the measure of equal sides are given 12 cm. So we will write here A will be 12 centimeter because two sides are of equal measure so if a is 12 centimeter then b will also be 12 centimeter because isosceles triangle means two sides are equal so c will find out from perimeter we'll find out c perimeter is given 30 so c will be 30 minus 12 plus 
12. So 30 minus 12 plus 12 gives 24. 30 minus 24 gives 6. So the measure of ABC we got. Now we'll find out semi perimeter. Semi perimeter means S. S will be perimeter by 2. Perimeter is 30. 30 if you divide by 2 will get 15 centimeter. Now by using Heron's formula we will find area of triangle. Therefore area of triangle equal root over S S minus A S minus B S minus C. Value of S is 15. 15 minus A. A is 12. B is again 12. 15 minus 12. And C is 6. 15 minus 6. 15 into 15 minus 12 will get 3. And 15 minus 6 will get 9. Now if you break. 15, 15 means 3 into 5, 3 and 3 are prime number, this 9 you can break, 3 into 3, 9. Now we will make pair, this 3 and this 3 is pair, this 2, 3 are in pair. So from pair, 1, 3 will come out and from here, 1, 3 will come out, 3 into 3 will get 9. So inside to it, left, 5 and 3, 5 into 3, 15. So area of the triangle is 9 root 15 centimeter square.